it sounds really good. And uh, and there, um, when I when I do things like that, so I'm playing that, mm -hmm. um, and, I, and again, I can I can see it in my mind, and. Sometimes I feel like I'm flying around out here. Okay. And so yeah. I don't. And that's okay. Yeah. In fact, I would even aim for the higher strings on those strums even more. Like try to try to make sure on that G chord that you hear this note come out clearly on the strum. Oh. So make even take a bigger stroke is what I'm saying. Yeah. Okay. Take a bigger swing at it, which is gonna make you miss the bass notes a little bit once in a while. Yeah. You get good. Usually you get a pretty good tone out of that. That hammer off, which is a hard note. So, one other thing that, could, that could, would be good to try to get in there. Um, after, usually after maybe the second down, although after any of the downs, mm -hmm. you can have a little hint of an up. Right there, I'm doing more than a hint. I'm making a real distinct up in there. Okay. But it, it wouldn't be bad to have a, 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 a softer one than that, um, mostly after the second beat. Yeah. And see, it doesn't even really yeah. sound like a strum. It's more just like there's something filling in that little gap. Right, right. You know? And that can, 